Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flailthus. This is the Gundam Battle Operation 2 update for September the 1st, 2022. And this week we've got the Hazel Custom High Mobility form. And of course it's also GBO days, so we're going to go take a look and see what is available. Okay, so, um, the special supply drop, one free supply do, uh, drop a day is back, so that's good. Um, that's it for the, for, uh, and the... One you can do uh, once during GBO days to get one uh, guaranteed three-star or higher mobile suit is also up. Uh, new to the DP store this week, the level 1 and 2 Kapool and the uh, level 3 Striker Custom. Uh, if there's anything else uh, in there, I do not have it, or I already have it rather, so it's not showing up. Um, the various uh, weapons for those are all in the store as well. Surprised I don't need some of those at least. No new custom parts. And the recycle counter. Uh, new, we've got the, let's see, level 2 Zaku 3 Custom is up, level 3 Mudrock, G-Line Standard, level 1 Isaac, Zaku Marine. Oh yeah, this is probably what's actually new, the level 1 and 2 Gazom. Uh, those have steerable missiles, so, uh, yeah. And they're fairly low-cost transformable suits, so they can be fun to mess with. Haven't used them in forever, need to try it again at some point, because I've... Had some people do some really uh, uh, interesting and powerful stuff against me in them. I just have never gotten to the point where I could do that myself. But, okay, we'll start with the one-off special supply drop and see what I get. Oh, just knock wood. I don't get uh, more power outages during uh, this set of GBO days like I did during the last one. I'd like to be done with power outages for the year. Ah, superstitious person that I am. I'm just happy to be done with August for the year. And level 4 Rick Dom, I've had that approximately forever. Or whenever they added it, I'm not sure when that was. Might have been fairly recent, I don't remember. But I don't think it was. Either way, we're going to do at least one spin for the Hazel Custom. Um, since I got the... Uh, uh, since I uh, got last week's mobile suit so quickly, I wound up with uh, extra uh, tokens, so... I'm going to hang on to those. Assuming I get the Hazel for, uh, Custom on the first 10 spin. Might go for a second one if I don't. Masala Saber. Just because nice to see more Advance of Zeta stuff as far as I'm concerned. Uh, well, there's a repeat of the Hazel 2. Not quite what I was going for. I still haven't tested out the original Hazel Custom, which I finally got last week with uh, uh, the Gogog Vertex. Um... Psycho Ains Type 3, Level 4. Well, there's a Level 2 Rizal. I'm not going to turn up my nose at that. Uh, long Barrel Zaku Machine Gun. Had it forever. That's another weapon that they've fixed a fair number of times. I think I need to... Okay, there's the Garadoga Commander Beam Machine Gun at Level 4. Interesting. Um, trying to think what you would use that at Level 4, but... I'm, I'm happy to have it either way. And I think I'm I'm a little running a little bit too hot on the mic here, so I'm going to have to move my pop filter back a little bit from it, because I think, yeah, I'm getting too close. Um, okay, so... Man, what can use that at level 4? I don't remember. Gym 3 Beam Rifle level 4. That's pretty self-explanatory, I think. Um... Uh... Farmer Gundam Mark II. I think that's what that was. Uh, sabers. Phileas Stream Galbaldi Sabers. And a Titan's Normal Suit. Okay, well, at least I got... Okay, yeah, it's probably... I'm not sure which of those those would use it at level 4. Probably the Regelgu, if anything. Uh, Gear Doga and uh, Quest Yag Doga both uh, seem to me like they'd be... Uh, too new to be getting uh, level 4s, so... Yeah, gonna guess the Regelgu now goes up to level 4. Eh, not bad to have the Rizel. I'm gonna do it again, because I'd like to get this thing. Though if I don't get it, I get to sleep earlier, so I'm, I'm not really averse, because it's been a long... Well, it's been a long August, honestly, so... Starting with that power outage and going from there, it's been a... It was a very long month. So, first up... Rick DS2 Beam Saber. Have it. Uh, okay, Jagan uh, D-Type Bazooka. Not going to say no to that at level 2. 
Um, let's see. Uh, level two of the Giradoga Commander Beam Machine Gun. Um, Dwudge Heat Saber. Uh, Zaku F2 at level 4. I've had that however long it's been in the game. Okay, first time we've seen the Fat Uncle animation this week. And Gazelle Growl level 2, which is a repeat. And two Fat Uncles in a row. Uh, White Rider Shekina. And... Masala Saber. Of course, I only have the level 1 Masala, so... Long Barrel Machine Gun again... Uh, it's like going to type 2 level 4. And the hat to go with the uh, jumpsuit I just got, though I'd had that already before, too. Okay, so yeah, the uh, Jagan Type D and the Echoes Jagan can both use that, so that's not a bad thing to have around. But yeah, that was... Well, that was a lot of recycle tickets to get me... Uh, going on the uh, bonus uh, tree this time. I don't think I'm going to be throwing the money at this to hit platinum in the first part of the month, but uh, if I was, I'd be tempted if I, I had it, just because uh, uh, Gune's Yagdoga, which I do not have, is the uh, premium login bonus for uh, platinum for the first, uh, first third of the month. But that's a lot of money for one Doga. I, I, I can't quite see my way to that. So anyway, that is going to do it for this week's Gundam Battle Operation 2 update. Good luck to everybody on their GBO2 Days rolls. And until next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later! <laughs>